Bruno Labadia appointed as 37th head coach of the Super Eagles. In a major development for Nigerian football, the Nigeria Football Federation, NFF, has announced the appointment of Bruno Labadia as the new head coach of the Super Eagles, Nigeria's senior men's national team. This appointment makes Labadia the 37th head coach in the history of the Super Eagles, a team renowned for its rich history and vibrant football culture. A strategic appointment. Dr. Mohamed Sonusi, the General Secretary of the NFF, made the announcement through an official statement, confirming that the NFF Executive Committee had approved the recommendation of its Technical and Development Subcommittee to bring in the German tactician. The decision to appoint Labadia was not made lightly, as the NFF had been searching for a qualified foreign coach for several months. This move reflects a strategic shift by the NFF, which had openly declared its intention to seek foreign expertise following a disappointing period under local coaches. Labadia's appointment is effective immediately, with his first major test being the upcoming Africa Cup of Nations, Afghan, qualifier against Benin on September 7, 2024. Just three days later, the Super Eagles will travel to Rwanda for another crucial qualifier. These matches will be pivotal as Nigeria looks to secure its place in the 2025 Afghan tournament. Labadia's footballing pedigree Bruno Labadia, a seasoned football figure, brings a wealth of experience to the Super Eagles. During his playing career, Labadia was a prolific striker, scoring over 200 goals across Germany's top two divisions. His time as a player included a successful three-season stint with Bayern Munich, where he won the Bundesliga title in 1994. Transitioning into management, Labadia has had several coaching spells in the Bundesliga, with his most recent being at VfB Stuttgart, which he left in April 2023. Known for his tactical acumen and ability to work with young talent, Labadia's experience in one of the world's most competitive leagues is expected to be a significant asset to the Super Eagles as they navigate a challenging period. A critical juncture for Nigerian football. Labadia's appointment comes at a critical time for Nigerian football. The Super Eagles have been without a permanent head coach for three months following the departure of their former coach, Jose Pasairo. Pasairo had led the team to the finals of the Afghan 2023 tournament, where they were ultimately defeated by the host nation, Cote d'Ivoire, in February 2024. Pasairo's contract expired shortly after the tournament, and he opted not to renew, leaving the position vacant. In the interim, Finity George, who served as Pasairo's assistant, was handed the reins of the team. However, his tenure was short-lived and marred by poor results. Under George's leadership, the Super Eagles managed a draw against South Africa and suffered a shocking defeat to Benin Republic in the 2026 World Cup qualifiers. With only three points from their first four matches, Nigeria's chances of qualifying for the World Cup look increasingly slim. The NFF's decision to appoint Labadia is seen as a necessary step to restore confidence in the team and to bring in the expertise needed to turn around their fortunes. Finity George, following the appointment of Labadia, chose to resign, leaving the NFF to seek new leadership at a time when the stakes could not be higher. Challenges and expectations Labadia faces immediate challenges as he steps into his new role. With the Super Eagles yet to secure a victory in their World Cup qualification campaign, the pressure will be on the new coach to deliver results quickly. The upcoming Afghan qualifiers against Benin and Rwanda will serve as a litmus test for Labadia's impact on the team. Adding to the intrigue is the fact that Nigeria will face Benin Republic, coached by none other than Jernot Raw, a former Super Eagles coach. Raw's knowledge of Nigerian football adds an extra layer of complexity to the task ahead for Labadia. The NFF and Nigerian football fans will be hoping that Labadia's appointment will mark the beginning of a new era for the Super Eagles, one characterized by tactical discipline, renewed confidence, and success on the international stage. As the Super Eagles prepare for their upcoming challenges, 
all eyes will be on Labadia to see how he handles the pressure and whether he can guide Nigeria back to the top of African football. The Super Eagles are gifted with lots of talented players such as the current African best player, Victor Ozerman, Victor Boniface who helped Bayern Leverkusen to finish unbeaten in German league last season winning the German Cup and Bundesliga, then finishing runner-up in Europa, Adamola Lukman who helped his team, Atalanta, win the Europa, scoring the hat-trick and only goals in that final. Also the likes of Trusakung the captain who also won the league in Greece, Wilfred Ndidi and Kelechi Inacho won the championship with Leicester City and promoted them back to English Premier League flight. Goalkeeper Stanley Nwabali has become a gold for his South African club Chipper United and many European clubs are on his radar. With this race of stars, the Super Eagles need a technical advisor who can manage the team well. For more exciting news on Super Eagles, the Nigeria Football Team and the Nigeria Football Federation, subscribe to this channel of Unculus Production on YouTube and turn on notifications. It's the manager of Avunculus Service, a Chegbilu Genuine Wojo David, saying thank you for watching. See you in our next video update. Goodbye for now. Thanks.